Our guests, Janie Whiteford and Charles Cobbins, are longtime friends of our On The Move television show. Our host, Donnie Yeager, first met Janie when they both volunteered at schools to help raise awareness of accessibility. And Charles Cobbins has memories from when he and Donna were students at the same high school. Today, we are talking about memories of past Hawaiian experiences. Now here's our On The Move host, Donna Yeager, and her guests, Janie Whiteford and Charles Cobbins. Hi, I'm Donna Yeager with On The Move, and I'd like to welcome our very special guest, Charles Cobbins. Welcome, Charles. Thank you. <laughs> and Janie Whiteford. Welcome, Janie. <laughs> Thanks, Donna. It's a pleasure to be here. Thank you. <laughs> now, I know that, Janie, recently you uh, had a wonderful experience and were able to go back to Hawaii. So, right? And there was a, a beautiful photo that you gave us uh, on, on the beach. And you're sitting underneath the big umbrella. Tell us about that. <laughs> oh, we had such a wonderful time. It was my husband's 75th birthday celebration <laughs> okay. with the whole family, All and right. it was just so special. <laughs> uh, we rented that wheelchair that you see me sitting in, yeah. and my sons took me down the okay. dunes from yeah. our house. It was right on the beach to the <laughs> right there, and then I just my hands were like that because I was like, wow, I'm here. <laughs> Amazing. It was Yay. such a wonderful time. <laughs> And to be down there on the beach like that yeah. on the North Shore of Oahu was so special. Wow. And I have to tell you, right where we were, Donna, is yeah. where all the sea turtles were. Oh. So we could look in the water and the turtles, huge turtles, at least wow. 10 to 20 every single day. Wow. It was cool. super cool. Oh, I love the turtles. They're so cute. Very fun. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, that's wonderful. <laughs> it was great. And then I actually got in the water, too, yeah, which was even yeah. better. Wow. Oh and those God. chairs are available to rent. Yeah, So cool. my son went and got the chair and rented it, and we had it for the whole time I was there for the week. Awesome. I got down there every day. <laughs> oh, that's fantastic. It was fun. <laughs> and I know, Charles, you have... Uh, memories when you were younger when you got to go to Hawaii, right? Yeah, yeah, that was great. <laughs> yeah. A cousin of mine lived there and his, yeah. <laughs> uh, his mother-in-law, who was uh, Japanese, actually yeah, um, cool. witnessed Pearl Harbor. Wow. So that was really, really quite interesting. Wow. She was sitting there that morning drinking coffee <laughs> yeah. and oh. watching the planes bomb. Oh. And, and she's Japanese thinking, oh, what am I going to do now? <laughs> yeah. You know, here's this tiny country taking yeah. on this huge yeah. country. Um, <laughs> You know, and, and she said that everybody was very gracious to yeah. them as yeah. being uh, Japanese yeah. people. Yeah. They uh, thank God for them that yeah. uh, Hawaii wasn't a state because they managed to maintain their business throughout right. the war and right. exactly. not be uh, yeah. sent off to an internment camp. So oh, wow. it's really quite incredible. Wow. <laughs> well, we'll talk about that in a minute, too. Yeah. More. Wow, that's amazing. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> And you, I'm, I just love your photos, Janie, because when you uh, were with your family, um, there's one of you actually uh, swimming in the water, and your sons were uh, assisting you, putting the pontoon wheelchair in the water, and you were able to swim around and tell us. Well, Hawaii for swimming, for <laughs> those of us that don't like cold water, yeah. is a godsend. <laughs> it is so nice and warm. Oh. And the, the wheelchair actually goes in the water, yeah. and then as it goes deeper, you start to float. <laughs> and as you're floating, you just kind of get off the chair and then start swimming. And it's and I was in the water for at least an hour at wow. a time, which was and not getting cold, and I get cold super easy. Yeah, so yeah. that was great. My boys were there. It had been, I think, a good 10 years <laughs> since I'd actually been in any water. So it was, wow. my body was like, whoa, this is interesting. Oh. But um, got used to it. And as a, every day I would swim, and it got easier and easier. Right, right. But, super, yeah. and, but it's, it was important to have my sons there. Yeah. They, yeah. It was a little scary to begin with. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> and then to get out, you just kind of float your body right back on the chair, mm -hmm. and they pull you off wow. amongst all those sea turtles. Oh, <laughs> oh cool. Which oh, my great. God. Very fun. <laughs> Yeah, you know, a yeah. special treat. Yeah. Right. Oh, that's wonderful. <laughs> How neat. Well, when, Charles, when you were there, mm -hmm. did you see many disabled people or probably not back then? <laughs> well, not on that first trip. Yeah. <laughs> um, and that was a different era when, right. when we were, it's the age of high school when yeah. you and I met. <laughs> right. Uh, things were a lot different then. But on yeah. return trips, things have really 
gotten a yeah. lot better. Oh, yeah. um, lots yeah. of wheelchair accessible yeah. ramps right. with right. all the resorts yeah. and uh, on cool. several of the beaches okay. on the big island that I went to there yeah. was also you know ramps going down to the beach itself right. from the parking right. so did you get a chance to see one of those pontoon wheelchairs? Actually, I did <laughs> yeah, in I uh, Kona. <laughs> yeah, and I thought this is clever. Yeah, and it's uh, you know long overdue. Exactly, so. and actually, you can use. Um, I mean, um, I used to work at Home Depot, so um, we literally, you know, would be able to design a wheelchair just with the PVC pipe. That's all it is. <laughs> yeah, it's it's so easy. It's lightweight, and uh, you know, it's really easy to put together and. And uh, I think the wheels would be a little more complicated. <laughs> but, you know, just stainless steel. <laughs> mm. Nuts and bolts in here if you got your chair. <laughs> but yours was beautiful. Your chair was awesome. I do awesome. have to say, I mean, I'm, here in the States, I've had the, the PVC pipe right. wheelchairs. Right. And this, it's smaller when, yeah. it ha when it's a stainless steel chair. It's a little bit smaller. It's right. easier to get into. It's easier yeah. for to people to help you get into. Right. I liked it better than the PVC pipe one. Mm -hmm. And I think it's a little bit easier to handle because it's not so bulky. Yeah, exactly. Right. Yeah. And it was easier for lifting. And yeah. Right, right. <laughs> I think if you go to Waikiki, where you were, didn't right. they have the PVC pipe ones? Exactly, yeah, they did. <laughs> yeah. It was very busy, and people were using them. <laughs> but that's okay. I didn't know that I was supposed to reserve them. <laughs> or like you said, get there really, really early. <laughs> Now, what really is exciting, yeah. though, is that they yeah. actually have them now. Yeah. And yeah. Um, I wish that they would let people know that you can rent them from an actual dealer that's right. there. Right. Yeah. So that you don't have to depend on the ones that are yeah. right there on the <laughs> on the beach that are available. When I was in college, I mean, they didn't have that capability. So the the Hawaiian guys just lifted me into the water. It's like, woo -hoo. <laughs> That was fun. Anyway. <laughs> That has its advantages. That's right. They did it the old-fashioned way. Which, <laughs> <laughs> but anyway, um, but your family, oh, it looked like you had a wonderful time. We did. With your family. We did. The <laughs> house we stayed in was fabulously yeah. accessible. Yeah. It really worked well. I brought two ramps, small ramps over with ah. me, which is what all that I needed. Wow. And right. um, the bathroom was accessible. Wow. So it was cool. all on one floor. Oh, fantastic. And uh, the rec room was downstairs so I could go. You know, it, was, it just yeah. worked out well. Yeah. And this is, I do have to say, this is the third house that I've rented. My oh, son yeah. lives there, so yeah. we go over fairly often, my son and my, yeah. my uh, daughter-in-law. Oh. And this is the third house that we've rented, so it's, it's not that difficult uh, to yeah. rent houses that, that are accessible. I uh, think mostly because it's the style there. Right. You know, it's a lot right. of flat. Yeah, and uh, they're open, open air, and, <laughs> yeah. and a lot of them are big with uh, you know, lots of room to move wow. around. Wow, that's fantastic. It was fun. Well, and you could tell the the photograph of you guys on the on the beach after your swim, your hair is wet. <laughs> it looks like you had a great time. We had a great time. Yep. <laughs> a little glass of wine, all. <laughs> Perfect. Perfect. Yeah. Yeah. It was very Perfect fun. Perfect ending to the day. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> And you could just kind of relax and then go back up to the house. That's wonderful. Yeah. Well, getting up was a little bit of a trip. I mean, yeah. I did have my two sons and my son-in-law. Yeah. And they, it did, because there's a very steep grade going oh, yeah. down the dunes. Yeah. But there was another lady there the wow. same day I was. Wow. And she had, uh, her family had rented the same type of <laughs> adapted wheelchair, you know, yeah. sand chair. And um, she was down there, too, enjoying it. Oh, that's So fantastic. it's not like it's that unusual. Right, right. Yeah, that's right. To do it. And you know, my um, my parents were actually stationed in the military a uh, long time ago, and uh, my brother was born there in Hawaii. Uh -huh. So we feel right at home whenever we go and visit. So they they uh, they had a cute picture of them sitting on the beach back in the um, mid fifties, late fifties, I guess. <laughs> and uh, and then I was I was conceived there in Hawaii. <laughs> Such a beautiful place. <laughs> That's my only claim to fame. <laughs> then we moved back to the West Coast, or no, the Midwest after that. Anyway, so, but uh, but that was a lot of fun. To, anyway, um, and then let's see, the, uh, uh, oh, the picture of uh, my mom and I in the lobby of uh, the hotel. It's really close to the, um, uh, the Royal Hawaiian Hotel. The pink hotel, yeah, <laughs> right there on Waikiki, on the on the right on the water, on the beach, and um, very pretty, very beautiful, and really accessible. They they really did a good job of uh, 
making it accessible, and uh, you know that really helped. <laughs> it helped a lot. <laughs> and then the um, the they had a pool even that had a wonderful lift that lifted you down into the water, and then lifted you back up uh, parallel with your wheelchair. So. That was very nice. <laughs> I think all the hotels have that now. It's mm, it's ADA, ADA, ADA requirement. Right. And it, but it, it really came in handy. It was very nice. <laughs> it was great. Did you guys get a chance to see the fireworks when you were there? Or? They had fireworks along. Yeah, <laughs> it was very pretty. <laughs> yeah, we. Um, my mom and I, I reserved a little uh, little seat next to the, uh, along the the beach there, and there was a wonderful. Uh, fireworks display every evening. So we were very lucky to be right there and up close and personal. <laughs> I love Waikiki though because you can roll that you can roll so far. I right. mean it's so yeah. accessible. Yeah. Either along this the ocean or yeah. go to the zoo is super accessible. <laughs> oh, it's there. Been there. And you could go all the way up to uh, um what's the, what's the mountain called? Diamond Head. Oh, Diamond yeah, Head. Diamond Head. Yeah. yeah, right up to Diamond Head all the way. Yeah, it's, there used to be yeah. a really long pier there on Waikiki as well. Oh, yeah. That it's still was, there. Uh, yeah. yeah, it's long. Looked it's like it was pretty accessible, now. yeah. Yeah, it's really yeah. nice. It's yeah. very, very accessible. Yeah, they've done a good job with uh, making things accessible. Yeah, and every hotel we've ever stayed in, too, has been yeah, super yeah. Yeah. accessible. Well, plus, Charles, since we've known each other uh, since high school, you probably have got kind of gotten a little more aware of, of the, you know, accessibility issues with the Hawaii. And I, I really think they have done a beautiful job, yeah, what do you think? Yeah, <laughs> yeah no, it, it's yeah. it's really, I think, well done. The resorts I've stayed in in particular, yeah. uh, you know, as far as the landscaping and everything yeah. around it, it's it's really, you know, yeah. kind of a nice little segue to get into some of the yeah. into some of the properties, you know, instead of just kind of going up the four steps. It's, you know, you get to smell the, yeah. the flora. Right. I don't know how much fauna you see, but you yeah. get to smell the flora and go over the little Beautiful koi ponds birds. and stuff, yeah. Lots of wonderful birdies and squirrels. And yeah. <laughs> don't want to see it. Anyway, we won't go there with the sharks. <laughs> <laughs> okay, but, never mind. Okay, but um, speaking of the hotel again, with the... Uh, they had beautiful ramps uh, all over the, you know, it's like um, the picture that we have is there's a massive flight of stairs on the right side, and it looks very fancy and impressive, but thank goodness they had a beautiful ramp on the left side there <laughs> to, you know, make it accessible mm -hmm. for the disabled person, because uh, if it weren't there, there, there would be no way of me getting to the, um, from the hotel uh, back onto the, the back part of the boardwalk, because but it, it was beautiful. It was really perfect, <laughs> and you could you could be included in all the different activities, the luau, and you know, <laughs> so it was wonderful. <laughs> How did you get from the airport to the hotel? Uh, we rented a van. Oh, you did. Yeah, it was a, a company minivan that you, they literally, you know, you call them and say we're here, <laughs> and they whoop, you know, pick you up and. Oh, but drive it didn't happen for the whole time. No, uh -uh, no, it, we just used it for the, for the, uh, you know, picking up and dropping us off at the hotel, and then when they drove us back to the airport to go home, um, we used, we took the bus. Oh, did you? <laughs> we took the bus a couple places, and that was fine. That was not bad at all. So. <laughs> they have a bus that goes all the way around the island. Oh wow! That you can take, yeah. Ooh, and I've done that. Ooh. I didn't go all the way around, but you can stop and get off, and you know. Yeah, it, yeah. And it is accessible. Yeah, you're right. Yeah, it works it's, it's great. It's very nice. Yeah. There are two companies on the island that actually <laughs> rent vans. Right. For well, yeah. the whole time you're mm -hmm. there, and and there's only one oh. van on the island that has hand controls. Oh, oh my god. If you goodness. want to drive it yourself, so that's kind of interesting. Oh yeah. Well, we'll get on that. Okay, would you, Jamie? <laughs> We need a little competition there. <laughs> yeah. Well, it's getting harder and harder to rent vans with hand oh, controls yeah, anymore. Yeah, yeah. I can imagine. <laughs> so anyway, um, and Charles, when you were uh, there last, did you? How? What are your thoughts about that? With you got to go with your dad, though, right? Oh yeah, when, when I was young. very young. Yeah. Right, <clears throat> but then right. as an adult, I've yeah. been to the main, to the Big Island more, yeah. <laughs> more than Oahu. So. Oh cool. Yeah, but it's good. it's really really quite yeah. interesting. Yeah. I don't know about bus service though on the Big Island. I mean, I'm sure there's oh. probably oh. something, but mm. uh, the resorts are kind of spread out. And, yeah, right. you know, unless you're in Kona proper. Yeah, so. right. Well, we had our uh, 
honeymoon there in, at the Big Island. And luckily, the people that we were staying with, they, uh, they had a, a, a camping facility for people. And um, so normally, you like camp on their property. But they built a room for me. And I can't even, I don't know, my ex-husband knew <laughs> the contact there. But they actually built a, a little room bungalow for us. Little honeymooners, you know, cool <laughs> and it was all that. wheelchair accessible, yeah. and yeah, but they were wonderful and drove us, you know, back to the airport and picked us up from the airport and drove us. <laughs> so I was special, I'm <laughs> very special, and we got to see the top of the crater and everything. I was, I was cool. That was lots of fun. <laughs> wow. So, but anyway, my uh, friend Diana, she, uh, I, I don't know why, it just seems like a lot of. People are right there right now enjoying it. And uh, my friend Diana just gave me photographs of uh, when she was there. She just got back last week. And um, uh, there's one picture of her with the beautiful sunset right behind them. And they had a private beach. And I don't think I'm going to name the movie star, but um, she, uh, she rented it out while she's waiting to have it be sold. <laughs> so she's trying to sell it, but that uh, little high so but anyway but they were able to rent it and uh, beautiful property and uh, and they have a gorgeous view of the Jurassic Park area where they filmed Jurassic Park and uh, that's really cool so but <laughs> anyway but she was she was very lucky to uh, to be able to stay there and <laughs> very nice <laughs> and then I guess they had a, a beautiful um, waterfall also that was I love waterfalls. Is this on Oahu? I, Which island? I can't remember. I think it's Hawaii, where they Kauai, Kauai, is that where they, okay, oh, okay. thank you. Yeah. <laughs> I've never been on that island, so I don't know. <laughs> but yeah, it, I mean, literally, I, she, when she showed me the photograph of, of the, you know, from the ocean, the photograph of the mountains, I was like, wow, that looks just like the beginning of Jurassic Park. She's like, that's exactly where they filmed. I was like, whoa, cool. <laughs> So that's all I knew. So what is it? What Kauai. 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 Okay. Yeah. Oh boy. Awesome. That's great. Okay. So anyway. <laughs> um, but yeah. The, but the waterfall was really cool to to see. And uh, usually most of the waterfalls aren't very accessible for the wheelchairs to to see. You have to kind of like hike in there a couple hours. No. <laughs> to to see a lot of the waterfalls. <laughs> but that was really neat to see that. And. Uh, Anyway, um, <laughs> Don, I just wanted to tell you one thing that, that okay. we did in Oahu that yeah. was so super cool. Oh yeah, <laughs> my sons played. My son and my husband played golf oh. on a golf course that was in the um, the jungle. Oh, really? In, in the and um, I rode along. They transferred me to the golf cart, oh, wow. and I rode along with them. And that was just oh, so cool. neat to do because. You wouldn't normally see this beautiful place oh, uh, from you. Wow. wouldn't let your wheelchair go on. Oh, so it was right. very fun to be able to do oh. 18 holes on the golf wow. cart. So it was, was the golf fun. cart itself. Yeah. Oh, cool. Yeah. yeah. And I'm sure it was lush and gorgeous. Oh, it was beautiful. Yeah. Wow. It was gorgeous. Just gorgeous. Oh, how fun. <laughs> you know, I think it's sometimes you have to get a little creative yeah. and just say, I'm going to make this happen. I'm right. going to do this. That's and right. Voila, there you are. Oh, cool. That's, that's, really that's a neat idea. It's very good. I like that. I like it a lot. <laughs> <laughs> and um, uh, then, I don't know if we had that picture, but the, uh, the Diana had a wonderful time when she was there, too. But the, um, oh, it's just so relaxing and so peaceful. I just, I love going there. <laughs> Let's go. Yeah, I know. <laughs> we take advantage of whenever we can <laughs> to get back over there. <laughs> it's marvelous. And, and like I said, the accessibility is pretty That's awesome. Great. And you, you found that too, Janie. Yeah, right? it, was, it was great. And when I was on Kauai, it was accessible too. That worked out really well oh, for us. Good. And I had, the hotel actually had an accessible van. <laughs> That wow. picked me up at the airport and took me to the hotel Great. when I was there. And that was a pretty. That was about 15 years ago. I haven't really? been there since. Oh, wow. Kauai is a really lovely island. Yeah, it oh works my out great. God. How did you find the plane trip? 
getting uh, over there. Well, that was hard. <laughs> oh, was it for you? Yeah, it's well, I, you use the aisle chair, and it's really narrow. <laughs> yeah, it is. It's really hard, and you know they're getting. I, okay, let me find a nice way to say this. Um, <clears throat> they're uh, they're trying to squish as many chairs into the airplane as possible. So the, well, there's no leg room. First of all. I hate that. I'm kidding. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I want sense of humor. Anyway, but um, no, it's, <laughs> yeah, my crew is going. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, but it, it really is getting tighter and tighter. So. Oh, I have to tell you, I was on one flight and <laughs> my hips literally would not go down oh, the no. aisle. It was that oh, tight. Oh my god. And they ended up having to put me in the very the bulkhead. Oh The god. very first yeah, seat, which right. does not make that. No, they put me in first class. Ooh. Ooh, which wow. was, uh, yeah, but then on the way home, they said, you have to pay for it. And I said, no, oh. you've got to make your aisles, you know. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, you have to make it accessible. Yeah, my exactly. body It's not my body's fault. It's your no, fault. It's your fault. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> but the, the last time, it was pretty good. Yeah. On, good. The, on the air flight that oh, we went. Oh, that's good. That's good. You, there's only that one time I had problems. Oh, yeah. <laughs> it's not well, full of five hours you're there. Just close oh, your eyes. My and gosh. <laughs> yeah, really. Be done with it. <laughs> Take a happy pill. Yeah, uh, yeah exactly. <laughs> you only another one, Martin. <laughs> That's the only way you can relax. <laughs> That's great. <laughs> so, but tell us more about your um, your family situation that they they were in back. In, oh, we've got a sign here. If you could, can you hold that up for us? Sure. Which Maybe way? Right, right Which in the camera? Little camera this there. Camera? Oh, there we go. Thank yeah, you. Yeah, it's just about. That uh, was cool. <laughs> little information about Pearl Harbor. Yeah, no, I mean, it was, as I mentioned <laughs> earlier, it was just that, um, mm -hmm. you know, to, to, as a teenager, to be there with somebody who had right. witnessed Pearl Harbor, it was one of those aha moments and something yeah. that was very impressionable and yeah. that, that carried with me for many, many years. Mm -hmm. But um, somebody who actually witnessed it and yeah. witnessed it as, you know, perceived, right. where many perceived them as Right. the enemy and they were yeah. anything but the enemy and, right. and literally horrified mm -hmm. but um, yeah, yeah it, was, it was impressive and and it actually put Hawaii in an entirely <laughs> yeah. different light for me as right. opposed to just the right. you know the resorts that are there now yeah. I mean just the historical aspect of it and then mm -hmm. also as it evolved into statehood and right. the politics involved with that that they were uh, yeah. you know sharing it was it was quite yeah. remarkable she Amazing. was uh, a remarkable woman but that's so. such an incredible perspective you have that I've never ever met anybody who who had that even close to that kind of a story it's really really amazing and I'm glad that uh, I'm glad that they were okay and that they were able yeah. to you know stay in their home and with their fan friends and family and you know mm -hmm. Community. <laughs> yeah, yeah, and that's what it was. I yeah. mean, they had a, a store, right. and you know, their yeah. customers were very loyal throughout the whole process, right, and, right, right. and a very um, sympathetic to mm -hmm. what could have been had they been in California, for instance. Or, exactly. Right. You know. Well, and also, Janie, I want to point something else out that the um, um, <clears throat> I'm just thinking, you know, all the independent living centers in the United States <laughs> um, have special phone numbers that you can call and we do, I have one that's here for the local Bay Area the San Jose area and um, I, I mean I'm not saying that they're an expert on every single aspect but uh, at least the people in the Bay Area in San Jose could could give them a call and you know ask if they have any information or uh, even a phone number of, of the local island that they're going to absolutely you know. I know for sure and there's one in Honolulu, but yes. anyway, so if they call area code 408-894-9041, then that's one possibility. And and then you can always go to the internet, too, and check it out. I'm sure there's lots of information. Yeah. I mean, I know there's lots of information there, too. But um, just, you know, do a search and Google. <laughs> <laughs> um, and, uh, but, the, you know, there's, uh, there's a lot of a wealth of information on the internet. And um, like we were talking about earlier, the um, the uh, sky's the limit. <laughs> you 
you know, there's so many things that are becoming accessible. Right. It's oh, I do it. have to say, though, I think oh. it's really important for yeah. those of us that really need accessibility right. to, to do our research because oh, yeah. um, we were just at a house in Tahoe mm. and they said it was accessible and we got there and it was absolutely oh. not. And that was an, on oh. uh, one of the one of the Internet sites oh. for renting Oh. facilities and it said wheelchair accessible uh -oh. called them up and they said absolutely we got there uh -oh. and it wasn't oh. so th so you do have to be careful and you yeah. do have to do your yeah. research and you do have to call the owners and oh, yeah. ask a lot of questions to make sure do that due diligence exactly <laughs> yeah. exactly that's important and, um, oh, and I think the the ILC's the independent living centers can give you a lot of information yeah. about the structure and the infrastructure that's there right. in that area. They're not going to know a lot of the minutia and the details about each, you know, yeah. particular place that you rent right. at each hotel. Yeah. So you do have to, as you said, you have to do your due diligence. Right, right. Well, that's the reason I'm, why I'm not telling you the hotel we stayed at was completely accessible because I had to use the bathroom in the lobby. <laughs> Because the one in the room was not accessible oh at all. Oh, my gosh. And they just remodeled, too. Hello. Wow. <laughs> wow. They put four steps from the shower, you know, down into the shower. Very pretty, very decorative. But then, then there was a wall in front of the toilet. So you couldn't turn the wheelchair without falling down the steps into the shower in order to try to even get close to the toilet. Did they say that toilet. was a wheelchair accessible oh, yeah. room? Oh, wow. yeah. They said they had nine other ones just like it. It's like... No, thank you. <laughs> Did you ask for a roll-in shower? Oh, yeah. And, and that's it, what they gave you? It's more like a fall-in shower. <laughs> wow. Nose dive shower. <laughs> wow. Kind of cliff diving, you know. Mm. <laughs> Whole other thing. Anyway, okay. <laughs> it's amazing how we make stuff work, though. You know, yeah. you just adapt, yeah. adapt, adapt. All right. Well, let me give you the phone number one last time. Uh, it's area code 408-894-9041. Janie, I want to thank you so very much. Thank You're you. very welcome, thank Donna. Thank you. And Charles, thank you so much for joining <laughs> well, thank us. You. Thank you. Yeah. And thank you so very much for joining us. Until next time, I'm Donna Yeager with On The Move. Have a wonderful day. <laughs>